So guys, uh, second position, we're going to work always from knee on belly bottom, but this time we're going to work on balance, okay? Because again, whenever we start on the bottom from side mount, full mount, uh, the worst thing to do would be to rush, okay? The more you will try to escape using strength, and the more tired you can be. The more tired you are, and uh, it's going to be long way, okay, in order to get out, you're going to get tired, and might the other person have the other opportunity to submit or get the better positions, okay? So we're going to work step by step on how to technically uh, move the person on top out of balance, okay? Because traduction for uh, jiu-jitsu would be gentle art, okay? So you also use the balance, the weight of the other person to work and put, move him out of balance, okay? Using a good, very good sweep uh, with my knee, okay? So look at the situation. I'm going to do it this way. So my part is going to have knee on my belly, and in advanced class or even in a competition, most of the time, a person on top has the thoughts of the ground, okay? So drive your knee more deep, yes, just like that, okay? And of course, we never know how the foot of my partner can be, okay? If it just uh, throws on the ground or throws off the ground, okay? For sure, I know that whenever his toes are off the ground, I can receive more weight on top of me, okay? So what I want to do now, again, the beginning is the same. I never want to really push him away, okay? Because whenever I extend my arms, I expose it, okay? You can attack my arm in an arm bar, spinning arm bar, or you can attack my neck. Again, never work on pushing his knee, keeping your elbows open, okay? You can attack your arms in, as, as a shoulder lock. So always start, arms closed, okay? Don't give him the chance to work arm bars or chokes. What I want to do is to create space at the beginning in between his belt and his belly, okay? So if my partner is on my right side, I want to control uh, like the extremity of the belt and I want to pull down. Whenever I pull down, automatically, I'm going to create more space, okay? So now with my uh, first hand, I want to reach for the belt. If you don't make this step, it can be a stupid step, okay? A very uh, simple step, but here, it's hard to find the space with your fingers on the belt, okay? Because the belt is tight. So I pull, lose the belt, now I have more space. And I want to keep my left arm at the beginning, stretch, okay? In this way, whenever he wants to apply more pressure, it's going to be harder for him, okay? But remember, your left arm from now should be stretched. You cannot pull and stretch. Whenever you lose and you pull, he can gain an inch, an inch, an inch, and then he conquers all part of your body. So, arm stretch. Now, I want to obligate him to move his foot on the mat again, okay? So if his foot is off the ground, a very easy way to drop his toes on the mat would be just from belly up, I want to turn on the side, okay? So look, I will be here on the side. Don't lose the position. He will need to move the toes on the ground. And look why also, because my arm is stretched, okay? So his, his base, his lift. Now, he will apply more pressure, so put more pressure, yes, just like that. The key is to be on your side, okay? Even your bottom leg. What I want to do now is to bring my left knee, okay? So the, the one is on top, right here. Can you see? Right between his legs. What I want to do now is move my left hand from this uh, grip right here above his leg, control my own knee, okay? So my left hand is just going to take the form of my knee. My right hand is empty. I need a grip. I'm going to control right here, the other leg. Now, what I want to do is technically, step by step, I want to arrive belly up and then uh, sweep my part in that way, direction where the leg is strapped, okay? So look, I move my left knee, my right knee in front of his foot. I'm going to lift his foot off the ground, look, right here. Look, 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 boom, out of balance. Now, what I want to do from here will be just control uh, the, the leg, the strap. And I want to stretch, control up. I will arrive on top. Always keep a good grip on, on the pants. I'm stretched, chest to chest. You have a good position on top. 